So about a month ago, I posted my first dropshipping video here on YouTube. In this video, I went a little bit into how I got started with dropshipping back in 2018, and since then have scaled multiple brands to six and seven figures and hundreds and thousands of dollars in revenue per day. This video did pretty well for my first video on YouTube, and since then, I've been getting tons of DMs from you guys for advice and mentorships when it comes to starting your own Shopify brand now in 2024. So instead of keeping all this information behind a paywall, I thought it'd be most beneficial to all of you guys if I went ahead and went in step by step how I build my Shopify stores from scratch using the same methods and same design as all of my previous six figure brands right here on YouTube for free. Back in 2018, it was a lot easier to build a Shopify store in just a few minutes, start running ads to it the same day and scale these stores to hundreds and even thousands of dollars per day in just a few days. But today I bet you would laugh if I showed you some of these stores people were killing it with back in 2018. 2024, it takes a lot more thought, time and experience to build a high converting Shopify store. Your design, product page funnels, branding, apps, and upsells all need to be on point if you want to even think about hitting your first $100 day. So in this video, I'm going to go over the four steps I go through in order to build my six-figure brands from scratch. Those are going to be your Shopify theme, your branding, your product page funnel, and getting your apps and upsells all dialed in. Oh yeah, and we're going to be doing all of this in under 10 minutes using some free AI tools I'll mention later in the video. We are in the golden age of e-commerce and it has never been easier to get started and start making sales with dropshipping. So drop a like down below. And by the end of this video, you'll be making your Shopify stores like these seven figure brands in minutes. Okay, so the first step in this process is getting our Shopify store set up. And for this, most of you guys are probably using the free themes that come with Shopify. Now there's nothing wrong with using these free themes, but these themes aren't gonna come with most of the features that we're gonna use in this video to maximize our conversion rate. So that's why I use this free AI tool, dropbase.ai, the world's first AI powered Shopify brand builder. Dropbase is actually my app that me and my team have been developing for the past couple years. We train Dropbase to build high converting Shopify brands that are based off the same methods and designs I used in my six and seven figure past Shopify brands. All you have to do is choose what kind of products you wanna sell, customize your brand's colors and banner image, and then Dropbase is going to build everything from scratch and import it over to your own Shopify account in seconds. Forget what first came to your head when you heard AI built store, because these stores look better than 99% of dropshipping brands. And they come packed with tons of features we're gonna use later in this video to try to maximize our conversion rate in order to get the most sales. And they're all built in less than 60 seconds. The craziest part is all of these brands are gonna come preloaded with winning products that our AI finds going viral on TikTok and Instagram with fully built product pages so you can start from zero and have a completely built Shopify brand ready to sell in just a few minutes. This is perfect if you don't wanna waste hours or even days building a Shopify store from scratch. So let's jump in and use Dropbase to build our Shopify theme. And from there, we're gonna go into the methods I personally use to get all of my stores to a five or even 7% conversion rate. So here we are inside of Dropbase. If you guys wanna try it out, you can try it for completely free. I'll link it down in the description. The first step is going to be choosing what kind of products we wanna sell. We have six high converting niches here. So whether you want to sell skincare products or even your own clothing brand, you definitely have the option to do that. For this video, we're going to choose one of my favorite niches, the pet niche. Pet owners love spending money on their pets and there's a ton of opportunity for bundles and upsells, which we'll get to later in the video. So we're going to go ahead and use the pet niche for this video. The next step is going to be choosing the colors for our brand. We have a couple different options here. It's going to vary depending on what niche you choose. But for this video, we're just going to go ahead and do a classic like blue look. And then the last step, you're going to be able to choose a banner image that's going to be on the home page of your theme. All of these are going to be optimized for both desktop and mobile. So just choose the one that you like the look of the best. So we're just going to go with the first one for this video. And just like that, your brand has been customized and saved. All you have to do now is install the Dropbase app onto your Shopify store. It's gonna quickly walk you through how to do that. It takes you just a few minutes. And from there, Dropbase is gonna build everything for you and install it onto your Shopify store in seconds. And just like that, after just a few minutes, our brand was fully built out and installed onto our Shopify account. As you can see, the store looks fantastic, but as good as the homepage looks, the most important part of our brand is actually the product pages. We aren't gonna be running ads to our homepage. We're gonna be running them to the specific product pages 
of the products we choose to test. So we have to make sure that these pages are dialed in. Let's click on one of these product pages, drop base built out for us. We'll just do this product here. These product pages are a perfect starting point. Everything from reviews to selling points is completely built out by the A. So let's go into the third step of this process, which is going to be dialing in our apps and our upsells for our store. So the first app that we're gonna go ahead and install and set up are bundles. This is almost a no brainer when it comes to increasing your average order value. Think about it. If you know you're gonna have to spend $10 to get one customer to come to your store and buy a product from you, you would want each customer to spend as much money as possible, right? So instead of only having the ability to offer one product to each of the customers that comes to your store, we're gonna set up bundles of our products so the customer has the ability to buy two, three, maybe even four of the same product and in return, they get a little bit of a discount. So this is the app that we're gonna be using. It's called Kaching Bundle Quantity Breaks. All you have to do is click the install button here on the Shopify app store and just install it to your store. So next, let's go ahead and just choose a product that we're gonna use in this video to set up the bundles and apps for. I think we'll just use this uh, dog portable hydration water bottle. That'll be a good example for this video. So go over to your apps, go to the Kaching Bundle Quantity Breaks app and then click add a new deal right here on the screen. We're just gonna name this the name of our product. So pooch hydration station. For the block title, we're just gonna go ahead and leave that bundle and save. And as you can see here over on the preview, this is gonna be a preview of what the bundle is actually gonna look like on our Shopify store. So you're gonna have the ability for your customer to order one product for a certain price, two products for a certain price, and if they order two, they get a little discount, and three, they're gonna get an even bigger discount. So this is gonna incentivize our customers to buy more than one product from us and in turn, increasing our average order value so we're able to spend more on ads to acquire a customer. For the visibility, this is up to you. You can have your bundle visible on all products or we can do specific selected products. So for this one, let's just choose the product that we're gonna install it for, the Pooch's Portable Hydration Station. For the layout, we're gonna be running ads on TikTok, which is mobile devices. So we wanna have a vertical layout. If you try to have a horizontal layout like this, it's gonna to try to jam it into the, the mobile view and it's not gonna look as good. So make sure you do the vertical layout. For cart, we're gonna come and click skip cart and go directly to checkout. For the bar one, it's gonna be the single quantity. If the customer orders one product, we're gonna change the title to buy one, and that's gonna be the standard price. For quantity two, we're gonna change this to buy two, and for quantity three, we'll change this to buy three. For the subtitles, I'm just gonna change this to save 10% and save 20. And for the badge text on quantity three, we're gonna change this to best value. And as you can see, that's gonna add a little ribbon to the buy three option. So it's gonna attract your customer's eye. And for the badge text on bar number two, we're gonna change this to most popular. And you're gonna see that there's gonna be a badge style for each of these uh, badge text options. For this one, we're actually gonna change it to the more fancy looking option. So that's gonna really attract your customer's eye. And you'll be surprised, most customers will go for this buy two option. And for the label on both of these, we're gonna add free shipping. This is gonna add an extra incentive for your customer to come over and actually add a bundle to their cart. So next we'll come over to customize, and this is where you can change the design of how this is gonna look on your store. For corner radius, this is basically gonna round the corners. So as you can see, if we change this all the way up, they're gonna turn to circles. If we come down, they're gonna have you know rounded edges on each of the rectangles. I, uh, I think we're gonna change this to around 10 pixels right here. This is gonna make it look super, super clean and match kind of the design of our store. And the last thing that we're gonna do is, as you can see, this badge background color is bright red. Now, if your brand had its main color as bright red, you probably wouldn't need to change anything, but we want this to match our store's theme. So if you can remember, our theme was blue, so we'll come over and we'll choose a nice blue color to kind of match the color scheme that we have going on. That looks pretty good. You can change this and customize it however you like, but try to keep it super, super simple. You don't want something that looks too busy or scammy, or it's gonna do the exact opposite of what we want and kind of scare away your customer. So we'll come up here and click save. And as we can see, if we come back over to our store's theme, you'll be able to see our bundles show up. They look super, super cool, and they match the color scheme of our store. And if we go over to mobile view, you'll be able to see what your customer sees if they get your ad on TikTok or Instagram, whatever you choose to run ads on. As you can see, it looks super, super good, and it's gonna incentivize these customers to not only buy two of your products, but maybe even three of your products. 
with no extra cost to you. So now you can see our product pages are fully built out with things like sticky add to cart, reviews, shipping policy, return policy, even some emoji selling points up here. So within like five to 10 minutes, you have a fully built out product page ready to run ads to. It literally could not be easier. And just like that, we built a potential six figure Shopify brand from scratch. I don't have the exact time to see how long that took, but I'll let you guys let me know down in the comments below. Like I mentioned before, you can try Dropbase for completely free and have an AI build your whole Shopify store for you in seconds. And if you guys appreciate the free value, do me a favor and leave a like on this video and leave a comment down below on what you're struggling with most when it comes to getting started with dropshipping so I can make a video to help you guys out. As always, I'll see you in the next one.